Welcome back to MT and Live in the Mountains. I'm here with Pastor James Heaton III. How are you today? I am marvelous. Wonderful. We're happy to have you. I um, mean, you're here from the, uh, you're a pastor at the Fullness of Christ Ministries in Banner Elk. Yes. Um, so what are, um, so you're here to talk a little bit about a vision. So go ahead and, and tell us a little bit about that. Oh, thank you, Brittany. The vision, folks, is this came about uh, two o'clock in the morning on Wednesday. And the Lord gave me this vision for Jesus Christmas. We're going to rebrand Christmas. And Jesus Christmas, and I'm going to just pick this up and pull it over here between Brittany and I so you can see it. Jesus Christmas, this is His birth. This is the star. If you notice in the star is the cross. In, in, in the star for His birth, the X is, a lot of people call Christmas Xmas or Christmas. So you've got your birth of Jesus right here. But here we have the cross. Now, the cross is His death. And I'm going to explain something too exciting about this cross just in a minute. But then I'm going to go on to Jesus Christmas or Jesus Christmas. Mass is His resurrection. This also is communion. And this also is go send and make disciples. So inside all of this, Jesus Christmas, and this, whatever you focus on is what you're going to become. Whatever you focus on, you're going to automatically receive. Now I know that there's a lot of controversy, happy holidays, Merry Christmas. Well, this just goes way beyond Merry Christmas. This is Jesus Christmas. This is what you want to say. Have a blessed Jesus Christmas. Now I'm going to take you a little deeper. There's a story behind all this. As I said, I got this Wednesday morning at 2 o'clock. I went to a friend of mine, a student, and he was kind enough to, to get this done for me. Then I contacted uh, another real good friend at Samaritan's Purse, and uh, he was excited about it. He's, he actually called it Jesus Christmas Ministries. He said, you need to... Uh, copyright this. And I said, no. I said, this belongs to the Holy Spirit. He said, no, you need to copyright it to keep it from being changed. So I had to get with a lot of other friends and another friend out of Texas got this back to me on Saturday night. Uh, Staples was kind enough to make this for me on Sunday. And let me say this real quickly. They have this at Staples. And I'm going to give them permission for you to contact Staples and you can get this done. You can have uh, cards, you can have Christmas cards, you can have stickers, anything that you want off of this. Now I'm going to take you a little deeper. Last night, I was at my father's house. He is 91 years old and my mother is 90. And they had a friend come in. She saw this and she said, I know what that is. And I said, you do? I said, because the cross is like the form of an exclamation point. It's not only His death, but it's an exclamation point to zero in Jesus Christmas. She said, oh, I know what this is. She immediately started telling me about it, brought me a video last night to my home to watch. What this is, there is a cell molecule in your body that's called the adhesion cell molecule. It holds everything together, Brittany. Mm -hmm. Holds your skin together. Holds everything in your body together. And there's millions of them. Millions of them in your body. The cell molecule. It's called laminin. How about that? Like this is laminated here and holds things together. It's called laminin. If you put that cell molecule under an electron microscope you can see what it looks like. And that cell molecule that holds everything together is this right here. Whew, hallelujah. Now, what we've got is now that we know what this is more, we know this, we know it's Jesus Christmas. How much more has the Lord put in here that we don't even know about yet? And with your permission, if you'll hold that just a second. I'm going to read you a scripture, and it's 1 Colossians. Jesus Christ, who is the image of the invisible God, the firstborn of every creature, 
For by Him were all things created that are in heaven and that are in earth, visible and invisible, whether they be thrones or dominions or principalities or powers, all things were created by Him and for Him. Now listen to this. And He is before all things, and by Him all things consist, holds everything together. Oh, hallelujah. <laughs> now, one other thing that's happened since this. The Milky Way galaxy is 31 million light years from us. The Hubble telescope zeroed in on the Milky Way galaxy. They looked into the black hole and guess what they saw in the black hole and sent the picture back? The image of the cross. <laughs> so the cross holds everything together. So now let's rebrand Christmas. Instead of Merry Christmas, it's have a blessed Jesus Christmas. All right. Well, this is fantastic. Well, thank you so much for sharing that vision with us. And um, and definitely, you, didn't you say you could get it on your Christmas cards as well? Oh, yeah. You can put this on your... Just get with Staples. You can put this on your Christmas cards. And actually, too, on my website, which is Crosses Across Nations, mm -hmm. uh, you can, uh, I've called the webmaster and told him, I said, put this on there to where people can go to the website and download it. Mm -hmm. So they can download it for free. Mm -hmm. And feel free, I mean, feel free to put it on anything and everything, T-shirts, hats, Christmas cards, stickers, anything you want to put it on. We want this to go viral. I would love to see this on the front page of the New York Times and all the major magazines. So we're going to get it out, out to all the Christian stations, all the uh, uh, secular stations. This is it. All right. Wonderful. Have a blessed Jesus Christmas. <laughs> all right. Well, thank you so much, Pastor Eaton, for being here. And, um, and this is, I came together quickly. Yes. <laughs> well, good. Well, um, is there anything else that you would like to share? I think that, uh, that you know, we talk about so much that Jesus is the reason for the season. And, and uh, there's so much controversy about just using Merry Christmas. So when you say Jesus Christmas, this really pinpoints what it's all about. Christmas is the birth of our Lord and Savior. And He is eternal life. And He will give you eternal life. Be blessed. All right. Well, thank you so much for being on our show. And thank you for sharing this with us. Well, thank, thank you. you for allowing me to do this and, and to uh, uh, use this media to get the word out. All right. All right. Thank you again. We'll be right back.